Hello everyone, Carlos here with Austin Kayak. We're at the 2019 Paddle Sports uh, Retailer in Oklahoma. We're with Jessica and our friends from uh, Wilderness Systems and we're gonna be talking about the tarpon. So yes. uh, most of you guys know the tarpon has been in, in the market for how long? Ooh, um, for a long time, at decades. least de <laughs> decades. And it's probably one of the most popular boats out there. It's really an icon, a staple of the industry. Yes. And uh, for 2020, we have an updated version of it. Yes, and kind of following suit with our previous updates to the Tsunami line uh -huh. and the Pungo family, um, it was it's up there in classic models, and we decided it needed a refresh. And so far, feedback has been really great. Um, nothing. Nothing structural underneath in the hull area has really changed. So still same great speed, which is what really sells the tarpon, yeah, um, and great stability for a sit on top with a stadium with a non-stadium sure. style seat like sure. this. So we still have your um, front hatch here. We did add a small track right here. Just more and more people are taking electronics with them. They need a place to put it yeah, and mount uh, it. Yeah. Yeah. GoPro, cell phones, cell phones. right? So. Um, before here we had a center channel that ran down it was difficult for people to take kids with them or if they had a dog so we've leveled it out a little bit more um we did add a magnetic water bottle holder here you know about that until now. uh yeah what it's, look at that? it's pretty great um everybody meet you know everyone's bringing a drink with them and where do you put it sometimes a cup holder is inconvenient sure. Especially when you're trying to maximize space. Yeah, and especially on a kayak like this, I would imagine something kind of that is molded in between your legs still gets in the way. Yes. Or here you kind of hit it with your shoulder. Absolutely. Uh, with your in the paddle. Absolutely. So, uh, magnetic water bottle holder here. We do have the dry box that we included with the new Pungo kayak console this year. Um, coming back for the tarpon, and it does have two positions that it can go in. So, depending on whatever's comfortable for open. you as the paddler, yeah. open towards you, open away from you. Um, we also have great storage underneath here. Okay. If you want to put a Plano box in there, um, if you have, you know, a, any kind of other electronics or there's something that you need to keep out of the way. Out of the way, but super, yeah, very, very accessible. Yes. Uh, they always kind of very uh, comfortable seat, kind of state kind of remains the same. Yep. Okay. The seat remains the same as far as design, but we did change it up. So we're calling okay. this our Cool Touch fabric. Okay. Um, it is a lighter color in the gray. We added some fun orange pop here, but. I don't know if you were around on Monday for the demo when it was yes. 100 degrees. Yes. This seat was um, on average throughout the day 15 degrees cooler. Oh, wow. Just by changing the color Just, of the fabric. Kind yes, of a different kind of yes. it doesn't get fabric. nearly as hot. Good. So great for Austin. Great for Austin. Right now it's 100 degrees every day. Yes, I know. <laughs> and then uh, lastly, which this is a really fun feature back here. We'll put the seat down so we can get a better look. Um, we have a, we're including a nice mesh cover for your stern stern hatch. Uh, it allows you to just keep things more secure. It does have a lot of stretch and give, so you can put large items back there. You can also, if you wanted to, needed some area, needed some room, and needed to roll this back and secure it like this. Keep your jacket, your dry back, but again, you can still keep this open. Yes. Put a cooler, your wilderness system, smell crate. Yeah. Okay. So if you, and it, I mean, uh, how many times are we taking this out on a lake and a wake comes by and mm -hmm. tip just enough and that barrel goes over, cooler, you know. So it's just a way to give you more security and allow you to have more fun on the water. And uh, for what I understand, a lot of these changes are uh, were carried over the whole line. And so now the 100 will not continue forward on 2020. That is true. We're going in from a 100 to a 105. Yes, 105. Adding six inches on gives you more volume in the boat, allows you to have a larger paddler in it. Um, we were getting a lot of great feedback from women sure. at the demo about how much they loved the fit and speed of this guy. So it, it we're... Same performance, same just kind performance. of better carrying capacity. And actually, I mean, that half a foot, I'm pretty sure, also improves some tracking. And improves tracking. Yeah. And it improves just, a, you know, a little a little bit more stability because it doesn't have to be as as wide. Sure. We took it in just slightly. Kind of gain it on the length on the kind of yes. Flood. Okay. Absolutely. And so 105. There's the 120 and mm -hmm. there's the 140. Um, the 140. No. 140 going away. 140 okay. went away. Okay. So so just these two. They're the most popular sizes. Um, I'm sure there's still 140s on the market, but it's just we're sticking to the tried and true. Trying to clean it up and give give you guys a better chance. Okay. To sell stuff. And we're then again availability spring. Um, the, uh, we're we're launching these right now. Okay, so they're out. The Back launch is going to be. Have them already. <laughs> yes, uh, it's August thirtieth. August thirtieth. Okay. August thirtieth, they're going to be available. Do you know top of your head uh, price point? Uh, Changes on pricing. Yes, slight. Well, the the 
105 went up from the 100 because of the size. So this one is now 849, okay. um, and this is 999. 999 and 849. So. Well, there you go, guys. Updated version of the tarpons. Extremely popular boat. So the same beauty, same performance, with just more features and kind of uh, a little bit. Of, a little bit of a modern feel with with the track to be able to mount your cameras and uh, some of the new trends that you see on other boats so uh, as always guys if you're interested on this or any other products visit us at ECK and please don't forget to share like and comment below and let us know what you think about the new tarpon 120 and 105 from wilderness systems